Look, isn't that pretty? Some more fall colors. So, what I'm proposing is a funding mechanism. <sighs> Hang on, guys. Yeah, even the slide area filled in nicely with these uh, rosehip bushes. They really stabilize them for the bank side. Yeah, just, um, you know, like Andy Griffin there on the vulture one. Just have to uh, go after the space junk and fund it by a class action lawsuit. You with me, Eilon? <laughs> Can say anything. Real Mars democracy. Yeah, there we go. Forum. Democracy. There's... No, I don't have to put that in at the end of the film. Yeah, so we'll, uh... Yep, uh, just, um... <clears throat> we got the means to bring before the judge to, uh... Clean all that satellite debris up. It's getting out of fucking hand, and pretty soon you won't be able to come nor go. There'll be a thousand year shield around my earth of garbage, satellite garbage. When what you should be doing is pushing that safely up into um, L4, Earth L4. And um, you want to do that because then it's it's there with the with the Pusher ion robot. Just stationed there in case it's needed elsewhere for parts or as a meteorite uh, impactor to divert an incoming meteorite that was, you know, 10 meter meteorite that was uh, discovered <clears throat> just as it got to within a million miles or whatever and um, you meet it out there and uh, divert where it lands, you know, so it's not landing in, in, in say, New York, but it's going to land in uh, upstate New York, you know, 500 miles that way where the population isn't so dense and the land can contain it, and, um, for instance, you know, or you need an emergency fix on something up there, and, Oh, we could improvise and use these parts here to get this situation under control. Well, there you go. You got a whole fucking junkyard up there for hundreds of millions of years, perhaps. Uh, you know, pending a super dense Ragnarok kind of supernova inclusion. <clears throat> that knocks them out. Or gravitational protuberance that knocks them out of L4. So, class action lawsuit of them. There we go. Got the means, and now, or the way, <coughs> the way is, uh, you know, pretty well at hand. You got the actual corporations to say, here's an invoice, here's what it's going to cost, judge. Here are the invoices, and you know, here's the study, and, and therefore, on uh, behalf of all Earth kind, um, I'm class law, action lawsuiting, this satellite company, that satellite company, and uh, using the proceeds to clean up what they want. I gave them letters of demands, they won't clean it up, so we go clean it up. Whether it's by Vulture 1 or or, or whatever. <coughs> X-Plane launched. Um, no, Bert, Tan, um, uh, Virgin, Galactic. Well, there you go. You guys want to do it or shall I? Or do we do it together or what? Okay. So there you go. And there's how we're going to get to Mars. That's uh, the first thing we're going to fund. And then we're going to do asteroids that share a common orbit between Earth and Mars. And that's going to be our safe way of conveying non-bulk shit. And we can linear... Uh, <coughs> Use linear accelerators to uh, 
send the order, order to where we, or the processed goods or whatever to where we want it, as well as to uh, steer the thing and, of course, corrections. You know, you land on it and add a bunch more mass, everything changes, right? Or solar storms or whatever, but that's the safe means. You get the robots to do that, and that's the safe means to get actual people out to Mars. And it's in an orbit, so, you know, <clears throat> you just go meet it, and then you get off it, <laughs> wherever, Earth, Mars, Moon, and your little shuttle. So you think you can handle that pretty low-tech shit, huh? Um, if not, then <clears throat> put your needs down and make them known, and um, everyone um, that wants to join in will join in in a partnership. Let's redo this bullshit. Oh, there's still time. And, um, those that can't get it together, if they want to do the 99% and 1% and kill each other off and whatever, well, okay, great. And when you've all, when you've killed each other off, well, there will still be some homo sapiens living on Mars that, you know, and all they took with them. I know. <laughs> Come back and, you know, with the fucktards having called themselves. Fucked hard being those that did nothing about it as well as those that perpetuated it because it's one and the same really in, in, in this instance. Uh, hey, uh, well, there you go. Make it so. Do you want to go? There's your way. All those that have been irresponsible in space, that'll be this per first lesson. Well, I'm sorry. There goes your stock value. Nobody's investing. And, well, it's over. <clears throat> but don't worry. We'll buy up the uh, infrastructure and the skilled workers will, that want to go to Mars will partner. And they'll keep doing way better shit instead of making kill tech and... Hey, you put the shit up there, clean it fucking up. You had enough time to clean it up, now the cascade is happening. Yeah, it's got to be cleaned up. So, off off to the World Court we go, eh? What say we... That So say me one, what say we all? Are you coming? Read. Let's go. Really not that big of a thing. Peace out.